All right, so I thought I'd put up a quick video uh, on some techniques on how to play. Also, um, when you go to restring this, you can use loop in or ball in strings, but you want to unscrew this plate till it's kind of wobbly. Then put all three of your strings through, uh, through the eyelets, then screw this back down with the leather underneath the strings. It's You can't uh, pass the strings without loosening this little bit of a tailpiece here. Okay, just FYI. All right, so I got a tab here. I've also got a PDF, uh, link to the PDF below. So I'm gonna go over this first exercise here. <clears throat> it's basically kind of a strum thumb for the uh, Dulcie Joe, okay? So you're just gonna take your index or middle, whatever finger you use, and you're just gonna strum the, the first two strings and then come off with your thumb. going to practice that so you get it nice and steady. Okay. Next exercise is a little more complicated and it's labeled exercise one. And it kind of resembles a a cluck technique but not really. It's more like a drop thumb mute but it gives you a little bit of a percussive effect. So I don't know if you even want to do this but I just started to throw it out there. That's what it sounds like up to speed, okay? So you'll strum all the strings open and hammer onto the first string, uh, first fret. And then you'll strum them again and come off with your thumb. And then you're going to come down with your index and thumb at the same time and hit the string and mute it. Okay, and then yeah. So you're gonna come down with your thumb, your index and thumb at the same time, mute it, give it that, and then come off with your thumb. with your index kind of complex you know so you're you're you got a muted note and you're coming off with your thumb and coming back with your index all right so that's kind of an advanced technique but it'll give you <coughs> um you know a a, a an option to sound more percussive with this. Okay. All right, and so the last four lines of this sheet are actually Sugar Hill, okay? And so to play that, we're gonna hammer on the first fret middle string, and we're gonna sh just hit that, and then we're gonna strum just those first two strings. And then do it again. All right. So hammer on first fret, uh, second string, and then strum. Thumb off, strum again. All right. Then we're going to come up and we're going to grab the second fret, first string, then first fret, first string, strumming all the strings, and then all the strings open. So I'll play that again. Okay. Drop down the second line. We're going to start to do the same thing. Hammer on the first fret, third, uh, second string. And then instead of doing that again, we're going to come up and grab the first fret, first string, strum them all. Then release it, strum all the strings. Then hammer on to the first fret, second string. Then strum, holding that uh, finger down. Then come off with our pinky. And then strum again.
so far, the first two lines. Hammer on to the first frets middle string again and come off, do two strums, thumb off, another two strums and thumb, and then first string again, second fret, first fret, all open. Again, you're hitting all the strings on this, and then strum thumb all open. Alright, so that line is. last line we're going to strum all the strings all open then first fret first string all open then first fret second string and then all open okay I'll try to play it through slowly show you that is because that's something to work towards and you play it in this the regular tuning without dropping down into the minor so and then once you get up to speed it doesn't sound too bad okay but that first exercise I showed you where you're strumming the two strings and coming off with your thumb. That's the exercise I work on because that's going to build your speed. Okay. All right. I'm going to go ahead and drop this tuning down. Again, you just want to drop that first string down to when you're fretting this first fret, first string. It sounds in unison. Okay. All right, so let's do cluck o hen because I know that's one you want to do. So this, uh, all the extra, all uh, everything I'm going over is on one page here. Okay. And so this is the very top two lines. Okay, cluck o hen. All right. So we're going to grab our first finger, first fret. Uh, first string. We're going to strum twice, come off with our thumb, and then come down to the third fret, first string, strum twice, come off with our thumb. Back to the first fret, strum twice, come off with your thumb, and then all open strings twice, come off with your thumb. Alright, so I'll speed that up a little bit. do the second line go back do the same thing first fret first string two strums come off with your thumb then slide up to the third fret strum them all third fret and fourth fret then we're going to do kind of a, a little run so it's going to be five four three and then one again so it's you can also hammer on if you want that last one. 
All right, so I'll go through it real slow. Okay, that does it uh, for this lesson so I'll get this out to you soon and um, I also have another one done because um, you know uh, it, it's an intriguing instrument so I'll have one too that I can figure out stuff on and put up to him so um, take care